Hey guys, it's Chris. Welcome to Casual Fragrance Channel. Today we're gonna go to Nordstrom. They got the new perfumes de Marley. I think it's called Perseus. I'm gonna check it out, see if I like it or I don't. I do a first impression on my wrist, maybe four or five sprays. I've been hearing a lot of good and bad in it. So let's go in here and take a look at it and give you my first impression on camera. Okay guys, just got back from Nordstrom in the parking lot here. Thank you so, so much for letting me try it on my skin. Um, it opens up fresh. You're definitely getting grapefruit. Definitely getting some vetiver. Definitely a fresh citrus fragrance. I wouldn't say this is like a beast mode scent. It's kind of light and moderate around on my skin. I did about um, three sprays. Um, I didn't want to go crazy with the sprays. So I didn't know if it was beast mode or not. It does have a similarity to fragrances like Terre de Mer's Eau Chivre. If you like Eau Chivre, you're gonna like this, but I feel like Eau Chivre projects a little bit better than this does. I do like this scent. I like the color of the bottle. Now, I just sprayed it on my skin. So let me check my watch. The time now is 2.36 uh, p.m. So I'm gonna hang out with Kelly, might grab something to eat, and walk around the mall or something like that. And I'll give you an update later on the video how long it lasts. But it's not a projecting beast. Like this one here, it's like it's close to the skin. Off of my skin here. Like it's not radiating or projecting. I got to be like this close to smell it. Now keep in mind, I only did three sprays. You know, I walk around and see if it develops more. But right now, it's an okay fragrance. It's not an amazing scent. It's not a hype beast fragrance. Um, but I'm going to wear it longer. Then I'll give you... Uh, my true first impression and let you know how it performs and see if Kelly likes it as well. Okay guys, I'm back. It's been about a half an hour now. I just picked up Kelly. She was giving blood today. So I have the new fragrance perfumes of Mars called Perseus. So here's on my skin, see if you like it or not. So no breakdown, which I'll post on the screen while she's smelling it. It's bergamot, grapefruit, orange, geranium, dry woods, amber grease, black currant, uh, vetiver. So how do you feel about this one? Mm -hmm. Does it seem like it's overall just a fresh fragrance or kind of green? Like I know, like when I smell, I kind of get like a very fresh kind of fragrance. But yeah, it's pretty fresh okay. um, and green. Uh, you know, it's not terribly interesting to me, but it's okay. not it's not that like basic to me either. Okay, it's not like it's not offensive. I don't think anybody gonna like no. this. It's a fresh fragrance, but. I guess it's not a wow factor, you know, for someone like Perfume Mar has a lot of great fragrances, you know. Yeah, it's not. No, knock your socks it's off. Not, it's not knocking my socks off. It's not like, ooh, um, it's all right to me, you know. I, you know, freshies don't do much for yeah. me. Um, but I like it. Okay. It's good. All right, from a scale of one to 10, what would you give it off of my skin so far? I only sprayed about 30 minutes so far. It hasn't been that long. Uh, like a six. A six? Okay. All right, guys. Well, she does like it. It's not amazing. It's a nice, dumb reach fragrance. Like you spray it and go mm -hmm. date night, casual. It's not nice. You know, but the price point's pretty expensive. It's like two sixty five. So, you know, you might want to get a sample first and try it out. But it seems to be okay. I'll wear it some more today and get back to it, see if it changes. And I'll see if Kelly likes it more in the dry down or the mid. Okay, guys, I'll give you an update now. It's been on my skin for eight hours now. Still smell the fragrance. Got to get close to it. Still smell it. And I like the fragrance. Like I said before, I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. It's not an amazing fresh fragrance. You smell other freshies on the market. It does have a similarities to the original Terre de Mez mixed with Terre de Mez Eau Chivre. So if you like Eau Chivre, you're going to like this fragrance here, okay? It definitely... Um, has two components of the Terre de Mesh fragrances, but it does smell good. Kelly likes this sort of video. She gave it a six. She said it wasn't that interesting, but it's a nice, fresh fragrance. And if you need the fragrances, you are going to like this fragrance. You're going to enjoy it. Could you get compliments of fragrance here? You sure you can. Somebody like you and me that are watching fragrance videos for years and um, buys a lot of fragrances, it might be redundant for you. But if you're new to fragrance game and this is your first time hearing about Performance of Marley, you're going to love this fragrance. Now, if you're going to think of Better perfumes than Marley's, I would say perfumes than Marley Selly 
is slightly better than uh, Perseus. And I would say slightly better is Greenlee. These are two of the best freshies from the lineup. If you have these two, it might be redundant to buy the new Perseus from Perfumes de Molly. I like it. My birthday's coming up next month, April 30th. I'll be 39. So I pray I make it to 39. And I might buy a bottle. I mean, I'm not going to buy it for retail. Your boy always got the hookup. So I'll get a bottle for a fraction of the price. You know, maybe in the 180, 150 mark when it hits discounters. But right now, 265, you need to sample it and see if it's worth buying at the end of the day. If I had the extra money to splurge, sure, I'll buy it for 265, not a big deal. There's so many other fragrances I would rather buy for 265 that have better projection than a new Perseus. It's like moderate projection. It's not a beast mode scent. This is one you could go heavy on the sprays. You could do six to eight sprays. You're not going to choke anybody. I did three sprays, and it seemed like it was subtle. It wasn't even heavy. It does have great longevity, and it does smell nice for a fresh and clean fragrance. Now, if you don't like Terre d'Hermes, the original, or Terre d'Hermes or Chivre, you're not going to really like this fragrance here. And some people say it smells like Bulgari Tiger or Creed Aventus. I don't get no pineapple to this pineapple. Black Current, I don't get it at all. Um, no Suspiro vibe at all. Or Verbato from Spiro. Don't get it at all. You get that vibe, maybe I don't get it at all. This is mainly a Terre d'Hermes original and Terre d'Hermes au Chivre mixed together. This is what you get with Perseus. At the end of the day, this is going to be a great spring and summer scent. It could be a signature scent if you just want a fresh fragrance to wear all year round. You can spray your clothes. It'll last longer. And it's a simple fragrance that can be mass appealing. Women will like the DNA. You know, I can't see one person not liking this DNA. Even Kelly liked it. And she's not the biggest fan of all these new freshies. She said it was nice. She gave it a six. So it's above average. I'll wear it a few more times because I am getting a sample in the mail from the brand. Um, so I appreciate that from Perfumes de Marley. And I'll let you know if I end up buying a bottle for my birthday or not. But right now, if you say, Chris, would you buy this fragrance? I would give it a hard pass because I'm not going to pay for retail for this. By all means, go to your local boutique, Nordstrom or Perfumes de Marley, and try that for yourself. You might love this scent. This might be your favorite fragrance to wear, and I hope you enjoy this scent. But if you don't, it's okay. Definitely check out Perfumes of Marley Greenly and Perfumes of Marley Selly too, because these are banging fragrances. If you like mint or spearmint, if you like green fragrances, check this out. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the type of content like this, please search support. If you're new here and watching for a while, click that red subscribe button down below. Make sure you like it if you want to see more content like that. And don't forget to click the bell icon to miss any future uploads on this channel. Be safe, everyone. I'll catch a new video very soon. Peace.